So I got a new helmet from a brand called Xnido, and um, I thought I would uh, just do a quick share. So I've been using this helmet by Bontrager, which has been awesome. Um, it has this wave cell technology inside, which um, the idea there is that it dissipates rotational force upon impact. So it's sort of that shear type force um, love the visor, it fits really well. This has been a great helmet. Uh, you know, obviously I'm into the high visibility color, so that's that's been awesome. Um, but I just got this Xnido helmet, so it's a new company, a new helmet, and um, I'm really, uh, I haven't ridden with it yet, but I'm really, it fits well, really interested in it. So its deal is a couple things. One, it meets this um, Dutch standard for um, vehicles traveling at 28, or impacts at 28 miles an hour. So it's like a higher impact standard. It doesn't have like a MIPS type um, wave cell shear thing, but it's, it's, it has a higher sort of a crush test, I guess. And then I'm going to turn on the lights here. So there's a USB port in back where you can charge it and you, there are three modes, so you have this visibility feature also, um, front and back, right? So this is probably more for, the front is probably more to be seen than rather to see, but I'm sure there's a little benefit there. Um, but pretty, there's three modes. Um, the This uh, visor is actually detachable. You can either have the visor or not. And I really like having my eyes shaded, especially, you know, morning or evening commutes. I like having a visor, but um, if you don't want that, there, you know, it comes with just the regular um, padding. So I'm really excited about this new helmet from Xnido. And, um, uh, you know, I feel like I'm, I'm whipping along pretty good on my, on my beautiful Aero Rider Grizzly here. And uh, so I'm going to be... I think more confident about being seen and being being hit um, and crashing um, with with this helmet. So uh, both are great helmets, I think. Oh, and the other thing is that this helmet, shockingly to me, is actually lighter than the Bontrager. I I was like on paper. I mean, I can't feel a difference, which tells you something. And then on paper, their specs are my my Bontrager is slightly heavier, which I was really surprised about. Anyway, all right, so I uh, just thought I would um, share out um, about the you know, new helmet option from Exnido.